Well, today the man who found the beheaded body of a Lawrence teenager testified against the accused killer, uh, the accused killer's classmate. WBZ's Anna Myler has been in court and has more on today's testimony. So far today, testimony has focused on the day the victim's body was found along a riverbank in Lawrence. Jurors had to listen to some gruesome details and look at some disturbing photos. The family of Lee Valoria Paulino sits in the front row of the courtroom, reliving the day the 16-year-old's body was found. Just feet in front of them is Matthew Borges, the teen accused of killing and decapitating Valoria Paulino. Omar Medina took the stand today. Photos show the path where he normally walked his dog, but he says on this particular day, December 1, 2016, his dog went left instead of right and started sniffing at the riverbank. Um, as I approached, I got closer, I saw her really sniffing at a particular area. Um, so I pulled her back and when I looked, I kind of second guessed myself, you know, I thought I saw a dead body, but I wasn't too sure because, uh, you know, it was missing some limbs. After police testified, Valoria Paulino's uncle and grandmother took the stand. We'll have their testimony coming up on WBZ tonight. Reporting in Salem, Anna Myler, WBZ News.